Well, hi, ladies and gentlemen. This is a stay-at-home grandma, and I'm bringing you what I feel about predatory loans, okay? I was asked to do this, and um, unfortunately or fortunately, I never took out a, a payday loan, but I know other people that have. I and mean, one of my students, as a matter of fact, years ago, was sitting in the class, and somebody, one, one of the loan companies told her car. And I remember seeing people going in and out and counting their money like on Friday and stuff like that. And I'm going, you know, when I really took a look at it, you know, it um, it made me think, you know, mm, I'm not going to do this if I don't have to. And um, lots of times people would tell me, yeah, they would charge you double and everything like that. Now, I did notice that around Christmas and New Year's and birthdays and anniversaries and Valentine's Day and some such, they are busy as heck. And so I guess my point is, you know, that there has to be a better way. Everybody needs a loan. Don't get me wrong. I mean, you know, if I needed, I would probably have gone to it. But, you know, for some reason or other, you know, I was just blessed. You know what I mean? A couple of times I said I'd go and I said, no, there's got to be another way. But, you know, it is predatory and it is very, very dangerous. And it you know, if you've got bad credit already, it can really ruin your credit. So I would be advised to try to maybe budget your money a little bit. I mean, I can't tell anybody what to do with your money, but like I said, there has to be some kind of better way and out of something. But that's my take on the predatory loans. I left the, um, the article that you can read in the, the, in the section, and I'll also put it in the comments section. So I love you. Take care. God bless. Bye-bye. See you in the next video.